can you explain how companies can develop a conversational AI framework that connects user intent with context? So we'll take a number of historical chat transcripts representative of what end users are asking, and we'll be able to understand historical trends throughout that. We'll be able to understand what keywords, what are the most frequently asked questions, uh, and how can we bucket those into what we call intents. Uh, when we are able to bucket a question or a piece of data into a classification or a class, we're then able to dig into that a little bit deeper and understand what entities or keywords or key concepts are being asked within that data. And we're able to marry both of our intents or our classes with any keywords uh, to be able to understand truly what that user is asking and apply an answer to it. So why is defining specific metrics for the user experience such a valuable asset during the conversation AI design? We have different metrics that we look at with customers, whether it be cost reduction, whether it be average handle time, whether it be customer satisfaction. So when we talk about cost reduction, it is the ability for those calls to be deflected or those engagements to be deflected, not having to pay for an agent to handle those particular engagements. When we talk about average handle time, it's being able to answer uh, your customers' questions faster, easier, more efficiently. Uh, even though you're paying for it, we might not be targeting cost reduction. Cost reduction is still targeted even by decreasing average handle time. Uh, and then when we look at customer satisfaction, being able to intelligently apply answers that your customers are asking your business uh, without it ever touching a, a human or interacting with a human uh, is you know, really valuable. And when you can answer your customers' questions intelligently, efficiently, uh, without them ever you know, engaging with an agent, it really provides you know, good satisfaction from a customer standpoint.